Hi everyone. This week uh, we're doing your love, uh, you know, like weekly love reading in connection with Venus in retrograde. Okay. So now, what is in Venus in retrograde? What or what it asks of us? Okay. I'm not gonna explain to you what it is, but it's what is asking of us. Now, Venus in retrograde is about self-realization. Okay. There are things that we um, we have worked on in our past. Like relationship, you know, can be in your job, career, passion, all these things that we have done in the past that we need um, to, to not to answer to, like put it into ourselves. Again, this is Venus in Aries, so this is about you being you. Are you being you? That's basically the question. And if it's still applicable, meaning are you applying it because you really intend to be or you're just stuck and not taking it on you outwardly it's a little bit complicated but it's really not it's really just about you and are you still applying what why you started it and why you're doing it in the first place now this is not asking for you to take action this is asking you to focus within and once you have done that realization yes I am who I am oh, is that a song <laughs> I am who I am because I you know I don't go serious right I am who I am and is it really what I want okay as far as beauty in within not beauty beauty but you guys understand me you know Venus right okay so I'm not gonna make it more complicated than that um, thank you guys for you know for for watching this weekly reading and here we go for each time hi Pisces Welcome to my channel, I'm Sal. We're doing your weekly love reading in connection with Venus in retrograde. Two kinds of deck. Um, we have Steampunk and um, Crystal Tarot, only Major Arcana, okay? The card that we're, draw uh, we're getting from the Steampunk is, ask the main question is, who are you? Okay, right. so if you're watching this, okay, now is it, this is gonna go and relate to your couples, single couples, okay? Just watch in the later part and it will connect, okay? So, who are you? That's a question. The, whoever I'm reading this for, ask, your, are, ask yourself because this card will represent who you are. Okay, so let's see what we have for Pisces. Okay, here we go. Oh wow, Pisces, you are in a sea. With a flock of different, you know, like same flock, but you're different. Okay, do you understand that? Okay, so I need you to understand here. Okay, in the question is, who are you? Are you a person who is just living a life where everything is okay and might as well just blend in? It's not about blending in to to stand out. It's because um, are you being a wallflower because because you don't even know. So you lost track what you are going, what, what you are flowing into from. So in the process, you got lost. You were blending. You, you, you know why you were blending. And then now, you're one of the, you know, you're one of the duck or swan. And then you lost your identity. So tune into yourself. Ask yourself, why did you want to blend in? Are you in a particular path in life that you have to do this first in order to shine? Because you lost track of who you are. Okay, so go and look for yourself. And that's the, that's the idea on that card. Now, this two major arcana that we're gonna get is about how you can, you know, taking action or it's affecting you. Okay, two cards. We have, wow, the fool comes out in all this. <laughs> and the hermit, okay, okay. So, okay, the single couple will come later, okay? So, now, okay, who you are, okay, you were blending in, you lost track of why you were doing it. Look from within, because when you did that, you have a goal and you took a leap of faith. You believe that you will be someone in the end or something in the end. There was supposed to be a fruition when you did this. And also, this hermit stage that you come from or that they are asking you from, okay, is the same thing that you did. You blend in thinking that you were going to an hermit stage because if you blend in, meaning you don't stand out, you're the same as everybody else, right? So you're all looking at the same thing, same goal. And the hermit is all about going that way. Everybody's going in the same direction. So ask yourself, did you do this thinking 
okay that at the end of following the trend following all these people driving you towards in one direction did you do it because you were gonna come out someone who is triumphant because the fool is about taking chance because you lost track so think about it when you followed something or when you set forth on a particular path why did you take that path anyway this swan in this hermit was going in a path ask yourself what is this path <laughs> Because you lost. <laughs> not that you're lost. Sorry, I'm not laughing at you. You got lost. Like, you know, like if there was a lamp in the hermit, where's the lamp? That's what it's saying. Now, single, okay? Single, couple, okay? Single, you are basically going through the tide of change, of, of you know, if, if it's dating, then you know what? I'm going to date. And whoever they want to date, I'll, I'll, I'll take them basically couples okay i'm seeing here that whoever your partner is you're losing your identity okay you're 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 being taken by their persona and you're losing yourself why are you in the relationship what brought you to the table anyway because you brought something and now you're lost like you are adapting to this person you know you're, you're losing your your yourself in, in a relationship now single the fool is here because when you're dating and you said i'll take anything yeah Seriously, you're just gonna take everybody, anybody. The fool is here. You're not desperate. You're just taking chance. Why are you taking chance when you know you've done the part of being a hermit? You just didn't see who was there for you or was there for you, single. Now, couples, okay? When you lost yourself being in this persona because you think when you take a chance in this relationship, okay, or you went with this idea that if I match this person, if I vibrate as the same as he or her, uh, she or he, right? Okay, <laughs> so, sorry, I'm losing my track. Um, did you do it thinking you will find yourself? So ask yourself, did you just got in a relationship to think you will find yourself and then now you're even more lost because the person didn't show you who you really are? So you can't find yourself if you're lost with another person. You find it on your own way, not with another person, by you. Okay, so that's going to be your weekly love reading. I will see you guys again next week.